back to my channel today I'm going to show you guys this frontal that I got from a company called um, luxfrontals.com um, I did buy this frontal with my own money and I found them on Instagram and they were offering a 10% off um, coupon with your order so I decided to buy this frontal I did buy it with my own money and I've already opened it but I really want to show you guys how it came because I thought the packaging was really cute and creative but um yeah so this is what the packaging looks like it comes in like a it looks like a giant Capri Sun to me but that's what it looks like and then inside they have their business cards here and the reason why I really wanted to hold off on my installation video for you guys is because I did try um I did buy this frontal from a different company I did not buy it from AliExpress this time because I really wanted to invest um money into my frontal this time because the frontal that I previously bought did not have um some of the features that this frontal here has I'm just gonna open this package up for you guys their frontal um their business cards here it's giving me a few of them and they just say um, Lux Lace Frontals are made with the highest quality hair and have the ability to achieve the most natural looking hairline in part. I have noticed a lot of YouTubers are getting into frontals lately. So um, I got into my first frontal, well my second frontal ever, um, a couple months ago and I really love it. So I think I'm going to stick to frontal installs um, from now on if I can, you know, find a frontal that matches the texture of the hair that I'm wearing. But this is how the frontal looks. It was just in a um, normal hairnet here. And this is what the frontal looks like again I did already see how it looks but this frontal is absolutely beautiful I don't know if you guys can see that this is what the frontal looks like here I did get it in a natural straight and it is um like a 1b color and I, I'm, I don't plan on bleaching the knots this time that is something that I did the first time when I applied my first frontal I don't apply I plan on doing it this time because um, I follow Ming Lee um on instagram and she says she doesn't bleach the knots on her frontal which i thought you had to because all the people i watched previously said they had to bleach their knots but she said you don't have to and i look at it now you really don't have to bleach the knots on it because um like as you guys can see here like the part this is a i think it came with the middle part as well the part isn't really the part looks natural without having bleached knots and i don't believe these knots are bleached they don't look bleached to me but let me just tell you guys that this frontal feels amazing the lace feels like really it's not like big it's not like thick feeling lace but it feels like very delicate but at the same time it feels like it's going to be very sturdy it does stretch um it has that double reinforced line that my first frontal did not have and because i didn't have that on my first frontal i did put holes all over my lace frontal and i was really kind of pissed about that because frontals do cost more than closures but i think they are very um well worth it they look so natural and you can do so many different you know more styles with it and another thing that my first frontal did not have is all these dips and curves this frontal here has um a very realistic hairline i haven't even plucked it or anything yet and i think it's a it's a 13 by 6 frontal so it looks like this it's very large most frontals my first frontal i ever bought a couple years ago was only a size um what was it it was a 13 by 2 and then my last frontal that i put in for you guys was a 13 by 4 and this is a 13 by 6 so i have definitely moved up in the close in the closure and frontal in wig rolls <laughs> this is a large frontal and it is it's big because it'll allow it'll allow me to um create a large part which is something i did not like about my last frontals i could not make a large um natural looking part so this part here is gonna be ridiculously huge i'm gonna be in love with it i can't even show you guys because it's not on the mannequin head but this part is going to be huge it's going to be huge i love how it looks i'm so excited and this hair feels so good this hair feels um like really high quality hair as well i don't see any annoying like baby hairs but i do see the the fact how you can make baby hairs because with a frontal baby hairs are something you kind of do need a little bit of or it won't look natural but i have seen people on instagram rock their frontals with no baby hairs at all just pushed completely back and it still looked natural um, another thing I've noticed about this frontal is that the um, hairline is a lot thinner and I went on their website and they said that their hairlines are actually a 60 density instead of the 120 density so it looks really really natural as you guys see here I am going to do a little bit of plucking into the frontal just so um, just so it looks a little bit more natural but um, yeah, I really do like this. I don't think I'll have a problem blending the lace in. I do notice that it's a little light, but actually I've used all types of color of lace and I have never had a problem blending it, but medium brown lace they said on their website. And I think all their frontals come medium brown and I did pre-order this frontal um, about a month ago and it did take a month to come because they're low stock right now. And I will make a video how I install this thing for you guys very soon. So yeah, check out their website and yeah, I'll talk to you guys in another video. Bye. This is what the frontal looks like.